All right, welcome back to the Good Morning Ninja Show. Yes, I did talk um, and I did talk um, with so much confidence because now we be the best of teletainment. Now we they give on us. So yes, uh, from the beginning of the show, we don't they run things they come, and uh, I believe so. When I don't they satisfied with the things that we they give on us, and we still get better, better things and stuff on uh, as it be. So uh, as it be, I, I promise on us some kind better interviews we will get via Skype. Due to say we know if we get our guests inside studio because of the coronavirus situation, we decide say we go top not you know, top them up with a better, better movement, and we talk say we go to bring our guests come into uh, the show via Skype. We're going to talk to one better individual today in name na Murphy Abadoni and a political analyst. We will talk on the matters of a uh, political situation within Nigeria and a lot of other things where they where they arise and I would go like uh, get your own two cents on top of this matter. Thank you for joining us, Mr. Uh, Murphy on the show today. We appreciate your time. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning, dear. Good morning. All right, sir. Uh, let's even go straight to these conversations because a lot of things are happening in the country uh, that are of national concern. So let's say, let's look at it. And uh, we were looking into the current situation of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission. That's the EFCC. And uh, it has been in the news. They say, okay, well, they don't carry the chamo of the uh, EFCC for questioning regarding some situations where they happen around inside. So waiting you go fit uh, which waiting you go fit talk about this situation because now waiting on the, the, the flood the news now and our current uh, conversation. So we'd like to hear from you regarding. Thank you very much. Uh, I think uh, first of all uh, that very sad thing. It's, mm. it's, a, it's, a, it's a very sad one. It's, it's unfortunate. Uh, it just shows that uh, we're actually still having a very long way to go, you know. Um, but if you if you look back uh, uh, back uh, let's say some years, we saw that um, uh, most of the people were not at uh, uh, the economic uh, uh, and financial crimes commission in one way or the other uh, always uh, don't get one issue. Uh, look at the uh, Paida Waziri, uh, Nuru Ribadu, uh, and, the, and the rest of them. Uh, so for me, uh, Magu's case wasn't even strange, you know. Uh, even uh, before now, there are uh, a couple of allegations that against him, and uh, part of part of it was the reason why uh, the eighth Senate, uh, uh, led by uh, Dr. Bokola Saraki, could not uh, uh, confirm him. Also, if you recall, yes. And uh, and uh, uh, coming to the recent uh, allegations, also. As as uh, as uh, made by uh, uh, the Attorney General of the Federation, you discover that uh, these issues have always, always been there. Maybe maybe some persons may say maybe it took uh, the, the president a, a longer time to, to to address it, but I think it's uh, better late than never. Now that uh, the president has, has summoned the courage uh, to put up a, a panel panel of uh, inquiry, so to say, to, to uh, investigate uh, Maku as the EFC chairman and uh, probably things that has uh, fired within the uh, period at which he has been the EFC chairman. For me, that, that is a step forward. It's a step forward and uh, from the way uh, it's going, it's finally now that has been suspended. That, that one self, uh, uh, now a good thing because uh, because he say uh, in the past you will have a situation where somebody go there under investigation and at the same time they occupy the position uh, office and they enjoy uh, a benefit of uh, those positions. That, that one sometimes they more common uh, uh, with uh, politicians. So I mean, for politicians, certainly those in elective uh, positions. So now that the man has suspended, uh, I go expect we go there a little patient, a little patient, and. Uh, with the patient to see what thing will be the outcome of the panel that is being led uh, by uh, 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 Justice Ayo uh, Salami, then whatever the outcome, uh, whatever the outcome is, I think the law takes uh, uh, its course from there. You know, uh, it, it good as it takes talk down because a lot of people when they talk say this is an uh, organization we suppose they make sure say crime no they you know no they happen and uh, this kind of organization no suppose they get this kind of issue with the person we suppose they in charge say because every uh, person we suppose take this position suppose they credible and they you know and and, and they transparent 
Now, still uh, talking about this issue, then we also the, the, the allegations now, uh, like 24 allegations now they put on top in head. Some of the ones that they talk say, uh, in the live above in means, in the in communication with some corrupted people. So these are allegations where they've been done put down and some other ones where they involved. So for them to talk like this about uh, 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 the EFCC Chamo, you feel say, uh, how uh, you go want to make Nigerians, they, they react to this thing? Is, it, is this a show of credibility or what did it happen? Okay, it'd it be like say we get small uh, technical uh, network issues, but when uh, we try to make them happen, we would, we would, we would try to reconnect back uh, to see whether we will fit, um, you know, fit follow up with this conversation because we decide to start with the current situation with each other. Okay, uh, are, are, you, are, are you back with me, sir? Be like say this network story. Hey, make way could have pardon us eh, because now so it take be now we take coronavirus don't cause where we need to do things via the internet now and uh, usually our conversations they usually the you know they in house we go bring the guests come the show but due to this situation now we need to do all these things via internet uh, but we will still try to reach out to um, Magu Abadoni a political analyst and we would like to get in two cents regarding the current situations where they happen. For Nigeria, as it may. Uh, welcome back, sir. Are you with me? Yes, yes. All yes, right. I was hearing you. Okay, so yeah, so I've been asking, say, as this thing take be so, uh, regarding the whole situation, if this is happening to be the body that's supposed to fight against corruption. And now, matter like this don't rise. So, just a show of credibility or what you feel, say, be, be the way forward regarding this kind of issue. Uh, first, first of all, uh, when you when you talk about uh, the allegations, uh, yes, uh, against, uh, I think uh, we must uh, re-emphasize the to Nigerians. Allegation remains allegation. Allegation remains allegation. The man so far has not been indicted. Do you understand? Yes. Uh, we, we need to make some of these things clear. The man is just these allegations are bare allegations for now. Uh, if he's living a very um, uh, expensive lifestyle, so to say. Uh, maybe people think that they live above the income and all that and all that. These are all, uh, these are all uh, issues that can be put before the law court. Then, uh, then depend not so on the evidence that will be available to back up uh, these allegations. You, you, you understand? Yes, yes, if, I do. Uh, they get affiliations, if they get affiliations with corrupt people, at the end of the day, at the courts to decide uh, this whole thing. But at the same time, too, though um, I will never, will never really grow as, as a people uh, or as a nation. Otherwise, uh, in some other climb, uh, in some other climb, the the allegations against him now, if it's enough for somebody to to put the resignation letter, you understand. But this this one not the common yeah. for, for our environment. You understand. Otherwise, Senator Klein, we don't see the bank will just resign. Say well. Because uh, because of the allegations against me, I, I'm resigning uh, to face issues squarely. But uh, that that was not the common. So maybe we we'll watch, see how. First of all, to the patient, like I said before, since there is already the matter has already been investigated by a panel set up by the by the president. You go there, not go there proper. Maybe we we'll begin the they, they give uh, uh, details. Uh, Detailed information on the same issue until we get the uh, outcome of the panel. Then uh, from there, the government also will not decide on what to do with whatever information the, the panel is going to uh, come up with. But, but for, for me, really, I think, uh, irrespective of the allegation, we will not go also through, uh, will not go through away the, the achievement of uh, the EFCC the under uh, under Ibrahim Mago last uh, in the last four or five years you, you understand because uh, we're not going to just forget the good side of things so 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 sudden uh, the man has made some good progress as uh, the acting chairman of the economic and financial crimes commission he made some good progress if you, if you do a little uh, research on the acting last five years you can make a lot of progress the man achieved a lot for the efc uh, uh but though that is not uh, that is not a reason 
let's say technical issues can they happen again but i believe say we could still uh, find a way to connect back to get these conversations in uh, because uh, we know say all these uh, all these conversations now we need to talk about and as they talk and now this narration we given her the opportunity to hear the thing as it be and we'll take one small uh let's say you don't come back hello uh Murphy, you there with me okay beautiful uh, yes, Nubex, yes, uh yes. Yeah, pardon our technical issues now the situation no we, problem. Uh, the the way the, the network they go we know say now nah, 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 the situation we find ourselves with that but, but we continue the conversation as it may uh now i go, right. I, go I go like um uh, ask uh, a current uh, conversation we happened recently and i don't know whether you did uh, um, are aware of them but uh, as it as it be so being um a, the efcc chairman for every time as the presidency don't suspend them they do they, they talk say they no go like make in the office while they be the check uh, on them and you be the talk say if now for some developed countries uh, if you don't talk say in one resign now the problem is say sometimes will it yeah hey he go say you don't he won't resign now if he resign you know say uh, the fear be say if person resign like that then which means say in one in don't become ordinary citizen and or uh, the the investigation go come the very 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 you know serious and very very strict so what you, you know feel saying that and the reason why he no go won't resign be that seeing the fact say if that won't happen uh, anything can 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 go south and again the second question where i go like ask me say a lot of nigerians been talk say efcc na political uh, tool some people they talk say na political tool na the the presidency where they uh, the, the party where they rule that time na in the controller and uh, they, 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 they don't see them as transparent so wait me your take on this issue based on say they talk say efcc sometimes it they look like say now nah, waiting the presidency they use or the executives they use they attack uh, the op op opposition party as at, as it may at that time we would like to hear your own take on this situation okay. thank thank you once more you, you see uh your for your for the first issue you raised yes uh, why uh, because we, have to, we must look at it from both sides you know uh, the reason the reason why you go say they is that people to tender their resignation once issues of this nature arise. Now, because uh, at, uh, in those same environment too, the, the process of investigation, they, they clearer, clearer okay. those environments. Because yeah, the process of investigation, the, 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 the personnel, the individuals that are going to investigate who, the institutions that are going to investigate you, they, 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 are, uh, they are models of brandy. In those areas, they clearer than what we get here, you know. Because one thing for Nigeria too, eh, you will not go forget. To sometimes you go see corruption in the course of it, it, uh, Magu doing his job, obviously. But you cannot add such uh, such uh, a huge uh, anti-corruption agency if you want work, make you not know, step on toes. And in Nigeria, judging from experience from, from what we have seen so far, corruption. They fight back. Corruption has a way of fighting back here in Nigeria. And uh, where corruption, they fight back. You don't know, take care of it, consume you. So we must also have that one at the back of the mind too. That now the reason why sometimes people not want just resign their position, the one who on to power with one hand, why do they use the other hand? They fight whatever battle that, that they face. Because sometimes you go say political that tone, they the most issues or some of the issues let me make i don't use the word most some of the issues especially when matters inside government for nigeria you see with it's full on that tone today one in one form or, or, the, or other. the other then, then, then secondly the, the second what was your second issue you raised another yeah, issue yeah the second issue was that people see the efcc as a, a political tool good, way good, good. ahead thank you so um whether you like them or not Except uh, we don't want them to see it ourselves. There must that political uh, affiliation, whether directly or indirectly. You, you understand? Yeah. After all, who is not actually a politician? We are all politicians, one way or the other. Like like a, a philosopher once uh, opined that we are all political animals. So, Marco, for instance, is appointed by a president that is also a member of a political party, not just a member, but he's also the leader of a political party. You understand? So 
first of all, if if you are a leader, if you are a president or a governor or even a, maybe a, a CEO of a company, first of all, you work, you want to work with people when you know. You want to work with people when you know, or people when who you know recommend to you. People when you you trust to some extent, people where you fit confide in and, and, and all that. So at that point, there must be some political affiliation. So now the reason why most for the CEFCC as a wing of the executive, as an extension of the executive. But after all, Magun appointee of the president. And that takes that takes us to, 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 to the point you raised earlier. Whether people go they hold up power one way or the other when they face in this case, Magu does not really have that choice, if I may say. Because okay. he's just an appointee. Just an appointee. He was appointed by a man. Yeah. And the same man who appointed him can decide, like, like he has just done now, suspended him, right? Yes. He has been suspended, but if, yes. If now, if, now, if now elected officer, nobody, including the president, to get the power, just suspend him now. But because he's an appointee, it's easier to handle. The man where I post and go always suspend upon whatever he likes to, to do with him. So that, that is not supposed to be a serious issue. Well, okay. we can go, you know, you know, it, it, the federal system, uh, a very complex system, very complex system. And sometimes, too, some of us don't say it, it, it's like the presidential system is even ahead of all. The system is far above all. That's why you say we crumble and crumble and crumble and uh, Sometimes we we'll just get to confuse the innate, you know, mm. because imagine a system where the president will appoint the, 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 the head of the agency of government that will tackle corruption. That already don't put a, 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 a clause. That already don't put a clause because we are humans now. We are humans. Mm. And especially uh, for our environment, yes. sometimes people go extra mile to do favor for leaders, even when leaders not ask for such favor. Interesting. You, 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 you understand? Because people want to retain their office, they want to be in the good books of, of, of their bosses. Yeah. This is just uh, okay. uh, natural. That is why the anti-corruption anti war at every point in time at the time of the day will extend oh. down beyond the SPC and the ICPC. Now, all of us fight. Yes. The government and put out of government. All right. Uh, okay, thank you very much for your contribution on that one. Before we wrap this conversation up, I would just, just like to hear your, get your concerns on a few matters. We, don't the, uh, we know the coronavirus pandemic don't be around, and a lot of uh, industries and things don't change. Now, there have been a, 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 an information that uh, the federal government is, uh, has put out for the uh, resumption of uh, graduating students to schools because of the examinations coming up. Uh, the, the lifting of the interstate lockdown, seeing that uh, people can now travel from one place to another, one state to another, and the, uh, the opening of the aviation sector also, um, so that people can still fly for the, the domestic flights for now. So what's, with, what's your final take on these uh, conversations? Do you think it's the right time to make these moves? We're um, still looking at the fact that our numbers of the coronavirus infected persons are rising daily and uh, it hasn't still had a decline at any point so what is your your thoughts on this then we can wrap this up here yeah the, 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 before we say uh if if but at this one at the right time or the wrong time the question is when is the right time and i don't think there's anybody for now that will answer that uh, question very correctly because like i tell people this uh, coronavirus is one problem that took the whole world unaware. Nobody uh, envisaged it. Uh, nobody, nobody saw it coming. But now that it has come to us and it does, um, you can see, you, you, as, 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 as a government, even as a people, we will continue to make our mistakes in the course of trying to handle the situation. That is why sometimes you see some of the, uh, the decisions when government don't make certainly Sometimes we just look um it, it was just look as if we're not really uh, taking the right decision but those those two who are handling this two are just human whom sometimes i think to could be confused over the situation look at for instance they talk about school the children they have since they have since 
most parents are not even working for now. You understand? Most yes. parents not they work. Some parents are children, not they work. Imagine those when they work for private schools and all that, and a host of other companies, when not they function, and then get these children to the day house. When these children they house, some parents not feel they do it in the day before again. There are some of those parents when they do some media jobs, uh, trades, possible market and all that. Because the coronavirus don't force their children to stay out 24 hours for seven days and for 30 days a month. This, these parents are now forced to stay at home to take care of these children, children. for the start and one. Why they are why they are also at home? These children says go to school, they learn something. And I just say by now, get some of them was supposed to up in the next class. Yes. And, and and other if you follow their school curriculum and, and all that. So it's it's a, actually a pity. I know I know if nobody, I'm not sure anybody know the right time. Just that some people too they feel say maybe the government for a little bit patient. Little bit since the, the, the spread of the virus on the high side. Mm -hmm. Uh, that it's not going to make sense to come open school where the children will also go contact uh, the virus and spread, including the child's the contact and spread. And but that now, that now one side of the argument. And I think uh, it's a valid argument also. Okay. But on the other side too, on the other side, how long will come to stay house? You know, how long will go stay house, keeping the economy at standstill, keeping every other thing at standstill? So. The other school of thought, they say, okay, maybe we learn to live with us more. Maybe we'll just adjust our style. Anyway, coronavirus has uh, naturally adjusted our lifestyle for life. Life is not going to go back to the old normal. There's already a new normal now. Hmm. That is why the other school of thought, okay, maybe we learn to adjust, which is why government also probably don't be come up with all these uh, directives. Use uh, your nose mouth, wash your hands regularly, use sanitizers. They keep a distance and the rest of them, you, you understand? So yes, yes. If we will try this more, then the key question is, this is when government, because they always say government say they could take some steps before schools go resume, before the students, they allow, first of all, the graduating uh, uh, students, who, who, I need to also emphasize that, the graduating students, which is uh, primary, primary six, six GS3, uh, GS3, and SS3. And SS3, the SS3. So uh, those things when government say they go put in place, they go allow them to go back to school. We need to also, as you now as the media, need to also have to ask government how well they don't implement this. Are these things on ground? Are they ready for this strength to go back to school? And once that is done, like I want to believe too, everything we do now and are like more like test running. Government just test these things. If it work, they go proceed. If it doesn't work, I want to believe they will discontinue immediately and uh, Go back to the, to the drawing board to, to to find a new strategy. So for me, let's see how it goes. All right. But there's no better time. We All cannot right. continue to stay All at right. home, out of work, at school, and everything. Even when we don't know when the uh, pandemic is going to be over. So let's watch as it goes. All right. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Murphy Abadoni, for your contribution on top of these matters will be, and then are still uh, matters of national concern. And we like the fact that if it uh, give us your two cents on these matters, I believe that uh, moving forward, we'll get uh, possible results. Thank you for your time, sir. To enjoy more of this, our Ubunke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.